Welcome to the Standard & Poor's Consumer Retail Healthcare REIT and Capital Goods Week in Review. I'm Bob Schultz, Managing Director, Corporate Ratings. In the healthcare sector, ratings activity was very light. We assigned one new rating that is the result of an acquisition. In the capital goods sector, we took one high-profile rating action this week, reflecting share repurchase plans in excess of proceeds from a large asset sale. In the consumer product sector, rating activity was mixed. Negative rating actions reflected Cisco's aggressive financial policy and continued weak operating trends for Elizabeth Arden. Our positive rating action was related to strengthening of credit metrics resulting from stable pricing and low feed costs. We assigned preliminary ratings to Cody on a proposed merger with P&G's beauty business. In the retail and real estate sector, rating activity was a mixture of upgrades and downgrades, driven by improved competitive position and higher buyout related leverage respectively. We also commented on possible consolidation in the pet retailer space. And to highlight the rating actions during the week, we lowered our rating on Full Beauty, Elizabeth Arden, and United Technologies. We raised the ratings on Omega Healthcare Mattress Firm and PFG. Lastly, we revised the outlook to positive for Simmons Foods and negative for Cisco. For more details, please see Standard & Poor's Global Credit Portal. Thanks for watching this update.